Hello and welcome. And joining me as always is Gary Lyon. Hey, Hutto, really looking forward to the start of this one. Today we have Carlton coming up against Fremantle. make their way to the middle for the toss. Carlton wins the toss. Both sides looking to increase their standing in the top eight with a win today. Can't wait for this one to begin and I think the crowd would agree too. They are on the edge of their seats. And here we go. It's Halton taking on Fremantle. Fighting hard was Lloyds. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Chips it towards half forward. Harris used the body to take that mark. Big kick required from this distance. Move it on. Puts it into the 50. Mark by Antonio. Decides to kick. Finds a target. Breslin puts it on the boot. Bit of a harsh call, but the umpire saw it as deliberate. She spears the ball. Doing well to intercept that kick. Punches the kick. Rushes with the kick. Doing well with the mark. With a driving kick. It's a foot race to get this one. Dug out the loose ball. Drops the mark. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Puts boot to ball. Good mark and looks to send it back. Drives it out of defensive 50. Takes that one strongly. Moves the ball by foot. Takes a strong mark. Elects to kick. Cliff does well to mark. Tries to gain some territory. Gooch missed an opportunity to mark. Hurried kick. Good body work to win the mark. Slow start for both these sides. No scores as yet. Ends up turning this ball over. Sinks the slipper into it. Nice hands. Works it across the ground. Both teams wasting opportunities. Early. Marks now and can send it back. Stevens controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Stevens has resources out wide. Bit unlucky as the umpire pays deliberate. Williams goes for territory. Harris found a way to mark that one. Uses it now. Lloyd found some space and marked. Moves the ball by foot. Good mark there. Messio goes with the kick. We are yet to see a score in this one. Kicks out of the congestion. Fumbles the ball. Squeezes out a handball. She can take off after that handball. Ball collected. Loins will be the recipient of the free. Kicks the ball deep. A race for the loose ball. Clifford hacking it out of there. 
Now it's a baller. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. Hacking it out of there. The loose ball picked up. She's got the football now. Lloyd dug out the loose ball. Both sides failed to get a score so far. Down it gets on the end of that handball. Used the hands and gives away the free. A spearing kick. Finds a target. Van Dyke rushes with the kick. Harrington got hands to it. Vessio couldn't stick the tackle. Now they look to trap this ball inside their own 50 and cause a turnover. The lead is now one. Unsure of their next move. Fends off the tackler. Rushes with the kick. Bought with the mark. The first quarter ends, and it sees Carlton with some work to do. Fremantle are up and about early, and I bet the coach would be happy with this lead at quarter time. A slow start to this game for both sides. Nobody really establishing their dominance early. Anything to add, Gaz? Fremantle are allowing the opposition uncontested. The siren sounds for the start of the second quarter. We're back in motion. Downey gets onto the ball. The umpire calls for a stoppage. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Just gets it onto the boot. Going for goal number one. Strong with the body and wins the mark. You'd expect this one to sail through the middle. This is a big kick in the contest of this game. A kick to hit the front. Gibbs wouldn't be happier with that goal. The first goal of the day for the Blues. Back in the middle to resume play. Downey clears the contest. Gains some territory. A clean pickup. Charged down by Harris. Showing some really good pressure there. Sweeping handle. They just got to do better here. Carlton lead it now by a goal. Antonio to kick it in. Plays on to herself. Just gets the kick away. She can put it through. Carlton by seven points. Antonio. Players move as they look to provide an option. Decides to kick. She finds herself in space and marks. She couldn't get the hand pass away, so she just threw it. Harris might kick a goal. That kick hits the post. Carlton by eight points. Antonio deciding where to go with the kick in. Keeps the kick low. Quickly onto the boot. Breslin soccers the kick. Kicks hurriedly. She takes the mark. Puts boot to ball. Takes a simple grab. Goes with the kick. Dalton with an easy mark. Looks up with the kick. Gathers it now. Stabs at the kick, and the mark will be paid. Carlton are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Van Dyke drives the kick. Got hands to it. Looks to move it by foot. Kane wins the foot race. McMahon gets the loose ball. Mops up the loose ball. That is a stunning goal. That's the first goal of the day for Corden. She's enjoying that goal. Oh, there's nothing in it. It's 
some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. That's a really good team goal. Carlton could turn the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. And we'll get a ball up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Needs a bit of a rest. Uses a short handle. Scoops up the ball. She's got the footy in her hands. Marked by Harris. Keeps moving. Uses the bump. Mops up the loose ball. She just can't get out of the action. The umpire pays deliberate. Interesting call. Moved on by Antonio. Kane grabs that one. Advances now. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Going for goal number one. That was sweet. They put through another. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. Carlton by eight points. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. The Blues got winning the ball out of the clearance and are capitalising. It's much easier to score when you're always on the front foot. Edwards manufactures a handball. The handball hits the target. Going for goal number one. And time to celebrate. Harris enjoying that goal. Carlton lead Fremantle by 14. Back with another centre bounce. Harris with the hit. Hosky just gets it onto the boot. She seems to be struggling at this stage. It might be time for a break. Goes by foot. A chance to gather the ball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Clears the contest. Has it now. Slams it onto the boot. Gibbs couldn't keep her hands on it. Half time and a Carlton 21 to Fremantle 7. The Blues have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Fremantle can't afford to be missing this many chances in front of goal. It might cost them the game. Thanks, Gary. With so much on the line, I'm looking forward to this second half. Players back on the field to begin the second half here. The game is back underway. Downey won the hit out. Using every ounce of energy she has left. A good mark under the circumstances. 40 metres from home. Look it on. She takes aim. Brilliant stuff. And she puts it through. She's enjoying that goal. It's under two goals now. We resume hostilities. Thump clear. Gets a quick kick away. Harris leading the ranking points on the ground. She's doing everything right. My ball, says the umpire. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Hammers it. Steps around her opponent. We'll get a ball up. Thumps it clear. Wins the race to the ball. Thank you. Thump by Downey. Clifford finds possession. Hosky coming onto the ground. The umpire calls for it. Winning it was Downey. She seems to be struggling at this stage. It might be time for a break. Horton wins the ball in the air. She spears the ball. Landed in her back on this occasion. Chips it towards half board. Williams gains possession. Decides to soccer it. 
picks up the loose ball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Punched away. Handballs out into space at full stride. Receives the handball. Breslin gets on the end of this. Spears the ball. O'Sullivan takes the mark. Channels a long kick. It's marked by Bowers. Gets it away. Missed the target. She decides to go for home. Offline for a behind. Carlton go over Fremantle by nine. The Blues are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Goes for territory. Gooch over the top. Gets a hand to the ball. Ball ends up with the opposition. Moody drops the mark. Just put it on the boot. Gibbs goes off the ground. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. Looking to rebound with this kick. Oh, she did everything right. Except take the mark. Rasparkas failing to get near it, Gaz. Yeah, she's having a quiet catch, Hutto. Where just throw it. Hosky, urged on by the crowd, prepares to kick. 50 metres from home. Going for goal number one. Breslin couldn't snap it. Pound kicks an incredible goal off the ground. Gets some reward for her efforts. Carlton, Fleet, Fremantle, 28 to 13. About to resume play. Carlton are getting first use from their ruckman. Uses it now. A spearing kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Clifford gets the handball away. She gains the possession. With the ball now. Just gave it away. Nice mark under pressure. 20 metres out. She can put it through. She makes the kick count. Full price. She's excited about that one. Fremantle close the gap to nine. Back with another centre bounce. Punched away. Where keeps coming. Sockers it forward. Bessia won herself a free. Kicks it long. She gives chase to the footy. Rosale drives it a goal. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Rosale puts another one through. That will settle her nerves. Gets her first on the ball. Her teammates rush over. Now they lead by 15. Carlton are winning plenty of the ball at the moment and it's allowing them to create plenty of scoring opportunities. Three-quarter time. What stands out for you, Gas? Fremantle need to continue. To time to find out what happens in this final turn. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Clears the contest. Is in her possession. Duffy unable to hold on. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent and it's a free. Takes it well. They're doing really well to chew some time off the clock here. Couldn't take it. Haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. She's gone missing lately. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. We'll have another ball up. Punches it clear. She gets her hands on the footy. The loose ball picked up. Gathers it now. Receives the handball and takes off. Quick hands. And they could be away here. She couldn't get the hand pass away, so she just threw it. Puts it on the boot. A mark by Loins. 
Elects to kick. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Brazale was taken high in the tackle. Uses it by foot. She can't hold the mark. Gibbs not getting much of it, Gaz. She's barely touched the ball lately. He gives away a free for in the back. Edwards thumps it towards goal. A chance to reload the attack now. Kick by Breslin. Does well to cut off the kick. 40 metres from home. Almost directly in front here. For Sparkus goes for it now. Hits the post. And it's a behind. 16 points the difference. Antonio ready to bring it back into play. Pound grabs that one. 40 metres from home. She takes aim. That one will really lift them. She's enjoying every second of it out there. This kick stretches the lead. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Fremantle have had a stack of uncontested marks, but it's not working for them at the moment. They might need to change how they move the ball to increase their scoring. Manufactures the handball. The handball hits the target. Has a runner alongside her. That goal is a tracker. A second goal in the bag. Miles all round. Fremantle reduced the margin. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. She did really well there and gets the reward. About to resume hostilities. Downey got a fist to it. Just put it on the boot. The ball is turned over. Well taken at ground level. Puts on a bump. They score to get the free kick. Now with a low spearing kick. They chase after the loose ball. Has to do better in that mark contest. Clifford pushes a low ball. The Blues would love to make the most of this opportunity. Moody has resources out wide. Just releases the ball. She's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. It's a turnover. Hurry kick. Touched over. Antonio weighing up the options now. Sinks the slipper into it. A strong pack mark. Wants to keep moving. Hands that ball to the opposition. Releases the handball. She has the ball. Goal scoring opportunity for Pound. 45 metres out. Lining up for goal number four. It was always pushing that post and pushing it so hard. It hit it. Carlton with the ascendancy over Fremantle, leading 43 to 25. Over the top of the pack. The mark has been taken. Got boot to ball. Mark in space for Clifford. Chose to kick it. O'Sullivan picks it up. Seen plenty of it. Fremantle will be having a hard look at the game when the review comes later in the week. There are things both sides can take out of this game, but ultimately there's only one group of supporters that go home happy. The final scores are in. Carlton 43, Fremantle 25. That's the end of today's broadcast. Thank you for watching. We'll see you later. It was great to be here, Hutto. I'll be back next time.
Yeah.